I said, I grew up here and, and you know, lived, lived here all my life. So, you know, it's, it's, this is my home. And, you know, this is, it means the world to me, really. You know, everybody helped me out. You know, no insurance and stuff. So I didn't have nothing. But, you know, it's, it, it means everything in the world to me, as far as that goes. You know, it's, uh, I don't know. I, I don't. I don't know what to think. Really, it's unreal. It's, uh, was, I mean, they come out here and, and uh, you know, they just, I mean, that, like I said, they tore all the carpet up and I mean, they, they worked. I mean, it wasn't, there wasn't nothing easy in there, you know, I mean, it was, it was all hard work. Trust me, I was in there, you know, for, like I said, a, a week by myself and uh, I had, I didn't even made a dent in it and they come out here and just, you know, and, I mean, we had, you know, it was just, I mean, it was, I mean, it, it would take me forever to try to do this, you know, by myself, you know what I'm saying? And, and like I said, I wouldn't have done, had it done right, you know what I'm saying? Because I, I wouldn't have been able to go as deep as I needed to go, you know what I mean, to get it fixed. And it is real important to you to be back in your home. Oh, yeah, place. yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, it is. Like I said, I grew up here, you know. something about our get a wire it, and the electric took care of Tell me a little bit about the teachers' involvement and why this why the school teachers are here to help. Well, you know, you know, I've you know taught all three kids as you know the other teachers. They've all you know been involved with the kids so you know it really wasn't a, a choice they just said let's do it there wasn't um, any thinking involved they will just open their hearts and their hands and their, and their wallets and said let's get this done and it's been an oh, outpouring of people that you know strangers friends um, teachers um, parents of students at the school that have donate things donate time money you know labor it's it's just been wonderful but it you know starts at the school with the people there that, you know, that care so much for this family and their kids and uh, want to see them back in a, a new place as soon as we can. We've had donations of, you know, roofing materials and and, and GUI whores and studs, but I mean, any little bit will help. We need uh, sheetrock drywall. All that's going to have to be redone because we're tearing all that out. We need uh, electric, you know, all the electric lines, wires, and everything for that. Um, even carpet remnants, we would gladly take anything. But, um, if anybody can just uh, reach out to their people, families, friends that uh, may have any type of building materials, we'd appreciate anything because um, just one step at a time, we're going to get this done. I know you had said that you'd really like to be able to thank everybody individually, which oh, yeah, is going to be I'll, such I'll, a big I'll task, but because it's going to be hard to do it that yeah. way, what would you like to say to each and every person that's God, coming God forward or is still God coming bless forward? You guys. Yeah, God bless everybody that's helped us, and you know, uh, it'll come back to them a hundredfold. One way or another, yeah, I can promise you that.